Hi, welcome to UA Technical Solutions. In this tutorial, we will learn how to disassemble the slide valve. Let's start with the procedure. Drain oil from the compressor by pulling the drain plug on the bottom of the bearing housing. RTHCs have orifice plates and the RTHDs do not. Reinstall drain plug once oil is completely drained. Note the quantity of oil for recharging. Remove the Schrader core on the piston housing, this will remove all pressure and allow residual oil to drain. There may be residual pressure in the piston housing. Use caution when removing Schrader core. Loosen all the bolts on the piston housing bolts. Leave three bolts around the piston, loose but installed, to prevent housing from coming completely off until it has been broken loose from the bearing housing. It may be necessary to strike on the housing with a dead blow hammer or a pry bar to loosen the piston housing. Install M16 guide rods or all thread. Install metal plate. The plate should be roughly the size denoted below. Install a cam handle to the piston housing using the other M16 bolt. Leave this bolt semi-loose to allow for rotating the handle. It may be necessary to strike on the housing with a dead blow hammer or a pry bar to loosen the piston housing. Once the handle has been rotated the cam plate will need to be removed and rotated to gain more torque with the handle. The cam plate is no longer flush with the bearing housing. If the handle is too tight to rotate, slide a cheetah bar over the handle to help pry apart the housings. Support the piston housing with overhead crane, hoist. It may be necessary to pry the piston housing slightly away from the bearing housing as it may adhere to the gasket. Slide the piston housing toward the discharge end of the compressor until it is clear of the piston. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe us at UA Technical Solutions. Let us know in the comment section the topics of your choice to make this channel more relevant to you.